All right, uh, we are still on this uh, deleting of evidence issue, you understand? So, as we have talked about it, and another comment came from another person from different countries, you understand? So, now, before we proceed, I would like to read out these comments that came And In this comment, this person really made a lot of sense, and I would like to us to discuss it as usual. All right, so this is what this person said just just listen to it very well this person said the one who deleted the comment is the scammer i try to put things out out there and scammer or scammers i don't think that i don't think let this point be looted this particular one i don't think that Frederick is the one who is scamming people out there so you see what i'm talking about you see what I'm talking about? That before we make any move, before we, you know, we conclude, let's just be sure that it's actually Fedric Lola that is doing all these things. Are you getting what I'm saying? So let me just repeat it again. This, he said, I don't think that Fedric is the one who is scamming people out there. Alright? I think it is very bad for these actors. It is a damn shame for the people who cares about these actors. And another thing, and another thing, stop sending money to these people. You know, this is exactly what I'm saying. You know, how can you just meet someone uh, online, someone that you have not seen, you have not, you don't even know the person, you don't even know where the person is from, I, whether it's a ghost, spirit, or human being, you just send money to that person, you know? It's, it's really, it's unbelievable. You understand what I'm saying? There are things that you need to deal with your common sense. There are things that you need to, you know, God has given us the the brain to reason things. I get what I'm saying. But it is quite unfortunate that some of us are not really making use of it because we, we can't just see people online and try to send them money. It's not normal. You understand? So, what this person is trying to say is that People should be very careful that you should stop sending money to these people. So, if you think that you want to do business with this person, make sure that you and that person meet face to face. If you are in Nigeria or the person is in Canada, tell the person to come. If actually that the person means to do business with you, if the person is seriously willing to do business with you, let the person come so that you people will see face to face. I've only said this anything online is, is not really good you understand so that is what this person is trying to say now let's just finish the comment one of them asked me for money i told them i will send a bank check the person got very angry so that is who that is who i know that is why i know that that person is trying to scam people out there all right thanks for your talk all right thank you so much thank you so much i really appreciate this comment all right you understand what this person tried to say that someone asks the, this particular person for money the person now said that he's going to send a check for that person the person just got angry that is when he knows that the person is a scammer so you know a lot of things are happening people are just trying to make money whether you know in, in, in a crooked way they don't want to work they don't want to like they don't want to calm down and make money they are just trying to make money by all means so that's why each time my spirit keep disturbing me that Frederick Leonard is not really the person that is doing this I get what I'm saying if only I've seen a video of all these things you people are saying a, or a chat I get what I'm saying so maybe I will believe that you people are saying the truth Maybe someone is deleting that that evidence. Just reason it. Just, just think it. Think, I, I just want you to calm down. You know, sleep over this. Think about it. Someone is trying to, you know, cover all this thing up. But it's not going to work. We are still going to be treating this matter until we get justice. Until we find out the actual truth. Because Frederick Lona's name is being, you know, circulated everywhere. Because someone is trying to, like use his name to scam people out there and it's quite unfortunate that some people believe it i get what i'm saying someone is deleting that evidence 
So the person, these people can do anything to make money. They can do anything, you know, just to make money. So that is why we need to be very careful. Stop sending money to people that you don't know online. I keep telling people this. Stop sending money to someone that you don't know. I get what I'm saying. You cannot just see somebody online and the person will say, okay, let's do business. Uh, and that I'll give you some amount. And you just submit yourself to that person and start sending your money. It's, it's, it's not normal. Sometimes you need to reason. I've told you people this. Let's just stand in solidarity. Like, come together. Look for a very vital evidence. Evidence that can end justice to this case. It's not just about he did this, he did that to me, he did that to me. You know, it's not about you you know pr providing what people can believe you know Ferdicona has billions of fans all over the world and it's very difficult for them to believe especially uh, when it has to do with their favorite actor you understand so it's very to go it's going to be very difficult for them to believe that you are saying the truth even when you are saying the truth who is going to prove it except your evidence you understand what i'm saying remember that remember that you are dealing with a uh, uh, a celebrity what celebrity for that matter so you have to be very smart with your you know your i don't know how to put it with what you are saying that he did to you you have to back it up with a good evidence you understand what i'm saying stop sending money i repeat stop sending money to someone that you don't know online it is is not good even if the person use someone's account you know to chat you if you have the person's number call the person directly find that from that person are you the one calling me are you the one that's doing this before you can take any step you know sometimes you know, people don't you, know, you just maybe you think you have money enough you can just start with spending your money i don't understand so i've asked you people this how did it happen okay you, you have been saying that fedig no has come how did he scam you what type of business did you put it together? I have not... So, no, nobody have answered that question. I have asked this question several times and none of you have answered it. You understand? So, you know, I'm just standing in the middle. I don't believe... I have not believed that Fidignona actually did this. And I am not saying that you people are saying the truth. I'm just standing at the middle until I see something that will, will convince me, something that will convince me to believe that you people are saying the truth. You understand? This is how to do this. Okay, let's just assume that this matter is in a, is in a court and they will ask you all these questions. Do you have your evidence? Even your lawyer will ask you a question. He needs to have some evidence to prove to the court. He cannot just go empty handed in a court of law. Okay, you say that you, you, you have provided the evidence that so I deleted or someone deleted, which I know that I cannot do such thing. When I be the one, you know, shouting that evidence, evidence is needed, evidence is needed. How can I delete it? No, for what reasons? What I'm just doing in this platform is just to end justice, to say things the way they are. Yeah, they are. Whether you are going to be angry or you are going to be happy, you are responsible for your own happiness. So the most important thing for me that I've said the truth and have impacted positively to the life of people out there you understand what i'm saying let's just be careful the way we do things online don't don't be so quick to trust people online you understand don't be so quick try to find out try to investigate the kind of person you want to do business with because 80 percent of people out there you know they just want to get your money just try to be smart enough know when somebody is trying to you know use your brain are you getting what i'm saying so fedic leonard might not be the one that is deleting that i keep re i keep repeating this find out the truth who is behind all these things you understand what i'm saying all right thank you and god so please my good people if you love what i'm doing please i would like you to click on the subscribe button to follow us all right thank you and god bless you. please don't forget this is chitiko and as channel where we discuss the matter as in the heart now we are still going to be talking about this passport of a day we are still going to be talking about it until we get justice to this case all right thank you and god bless you. i appreciate all my view i appreciate your your polite comment how you have been making your time to watch the video to comment all right thank you 
and God bless everyone.